Thank you for tuning in to Race Crews. Here we have a USA 2016 in case assortment. When I opened up the worldwide assortment, we got a 17 Ford GT Super Treasure Hunt. I hope at least the regular Ford GTs in this case. Uh, I would show you that Super, except I just moved into my new warehouse. So now I have a lot more room. Here I have a track, there's my carpet so I can set up track time. I got my filming table for basically uh, my track and my playset reviews. And a big old warehouse, if you want to check that out, I'll give you the link to the uh, warehouse tour. Give you an idea of what I'm working on. Now, let's hope that I can get another 2017 uh, Ford GT in this worldwide in case. Let's crack it open. Oh, look at that. Nice color. Looks like a Ford GT all by itself up in the corner. Mm, could be. Let's see. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Another 17 Ford GT. I got one in the basic in the worldwide case, and now I got one in the USA, USA case. Fantastic. The Ford GT, if you follow me on the, uh, in the Race Grooves community on Facebook, you know that the Ford GT is one of my favorite cars. Maybe not necessarily the uh, 17 Ford GT. I kind of like the, uh, the other style of it. There's the TH logo for Super Treasure Hunt. It's got special paint, rubber tires. Very cool. <laughs> I bought two on eBay before I got my cases. Uh, someone was reselling the Super Treasure Hunt. Got me a couple. And next thing you know, I got two more in the cases. Uh, I'm going to keep them. Thank you very much. Here we have the 16 Ford Focus RS. Now, because these are on USA cards, we get these new for 2016 indications on the packages. 16 Ford Focus RS. No taillight tampos. No tail tampos on top, but I guess the headlight tampos and this Ford tampo is probably considered a... Uh, uh, top imprint application. Hmm, pretty exciting. I like to get more basic Ford GTs too because I use them for track time. Uh, by the way, you can suggest a model or two for track time and uh, you might get a shout out. One or two models only, please. 1985 Honda CRX MR11, 17 Acura NSX. You got uh, some imprints in the front, uh, painted roof, taillight tampos on the CRX. Is it CRX? Sorry, I've got to look, make sure. It's got some decorations on it as well. And here's the soccer car MR11. I forgot the gentleman's name. MR uh, is a soccer player, MR11 Russo. I forgot, I forgot who they actually named this for. I think it was a, a Spanish soccer player. But that's why this model comes out again with a soccer decoration. And it has the uh, soccer imprints. And did it have it on the base? Yeah, on the base too. You can see like the, uh, the pattern of a soccer ball, how it is um, painted, printed. Speed dozer in orange. Bone shaker, two samples in green. And I mentioned track time. Yeah, I do track time with uh, maybe like 18 models out of the case. So you can post a suggestion or two for track time, and you might have a sh chance at a shout out. Rapid response in yellow, ice shredder, and the 15 Mazda MX-5 Miata. Nice decorations. No taillight tampos. And we have the 73 BMW 3.0 CSL race car in black. Quick and sick, as well as maximum leeway. And by the way, when you suggest a model for track time, you don't necessarily have to pick a car that you know is going to work on the track, because it's kind of fun to see which ones might work. That's the purpose of track time, is to test models on the track, right? Just because it says like it's a track car, this one right here says best for the track. Well, I'd like to test that one out, but we'd also like to test out the the cool cars like the McLaren P1. And this one here, Corvette C7R, it has this uh, curved front part, so that probably works on the track as well. This is in the race team decorations. And here's Tank Nader, 
I like the uh, camouflage pattern. It looks pretty cool. Three samples of What's Up. Very colorful for fans of the What's Up model. What's Up, as I should say, Watts. Because Watts is a, an electronic uh, measure, or I should say a measure of electricity. We got two cars. We got two. Here's three now. Two samples of Bull Whip, again from the Race Team Series. I'll look at his roof in just a moment. Here you have Mad Props like that red, white, and blue decoration. It has a spinning propeller. And since this one's the uh, race team decorations, there's the uh, decorations for race team. Uh, probably not one of the better ones out of the race team series. That uh, Corvette that I just showed, th this one probably not exactly my favorite race team yet, but, but there has been, there is a couple. Hopefully it's in this case so I can show it. One that's pretty attractive to me. Nissan Skyline GTR R34. Definitely a collector favorite. Renault Sport RS01. Formula flashback, again from Race Team. And there's his uh, colorations for his release. Another Mad Props. A couple samples of Turbot with the opening hood. Love this color, looks fantastic. BMW K1300R. Here we have the VW Custom 69 Volkswagen Squareback. This is the uh, second colorway. If you're a newer collector, there was another release earlier in the year. 69 Dodge Coronet Super B from the uh, HW Flames series. If you're a brand new collector, this is actually the second color. Earlier in the year, they had like a, a teal green color. And that one's kind of nice too. This is W for the HW Art Cars series. And you get all 10 of the cars. You can spell HW Art Cars, and then the last one has the number 16. It's a Mustang. I don't, I don't remember if that Mustang is in this case. We'll find out, that's for sure. Here's another Art Car. There's an A, and that's how you get your A for Art Cars. Combat Medic, Epic Fast, and Drifta. He's a good track car, or she. It's in pink, so is it he or she? I don't know. Uh, what did I say? That, that might be regular Ford GTs. Uh, red Mustang. This one right here, I think. I'm not sure. Anyways, move on. Actually, that, that art car is Mustang with the number 16 on the roof. That has two colors, too. Blitz Speeder in yellow. This was a 2016 new model, but this is not the first release. It's already appeared in the cases. There's another MR11. I like this colorway for the 70 Ford Escort RS 1600. Got uh, red, white, and green. Another Speed Dozer. Hot Wheels High in a nice shiny gold chrome. I like this Cyclone, 69 Mercury Cyclone. Very unique uh, s style model. You know, one of my lights, this light over here, is uh, I just getting set up, so one of my lights is a little off. But anyways, BMW M4. I'm actually planning on doing the case unboxing videos in another room I have over there, so I have the lights set up all the time. Right now, I'm doing a uh, sponsored video, and so that's why I have lights set up a certain way. Terrain Storm, Fast Cash. This is a cool model coming back. Uh, you know what? Uh, it's in the HW Tool in One series. This car right here, it's a money clip. You can flip, you can put your money in there. Does it show? Yes, yeah, you look right there. They show you putting your uh, paper bills in there. And on the base, if you check it out, it also has different monetary systems. Oh, look, it still has the track loop symbol. They haven't changed that part of the base. I can't even see. Uh, this, when you see this, this, this doesn't mean that it's a treasure hunt. Let me get a po pointer here. This doesn't mean that it's a treasure hunt. That's a track loop symbol. And Mattel used to use that symbol to indicate uh, cars that were track cars. They don't put that on the base anymore, but on the packages, see right there, they say uh, best for the track. So anyways, uh, by the way, J22 base code. So this means this case was produced the twenty in 2016, that's J. And 22 means it was produced the 22nd week of 2016. So anyways, on the base, fast cash, they have different monetary symbols. 
Here you have a symbol. You see these two? These are a different monetary symbol. That's a monetary symbol for a different country. Uh, I think this is a symbol for somebody's monetary. Maybe uh, if you recognize them, you can post them. I don't remember off the top of my head what each symbol, which country each symbol goes for. And let's see. Here's, here's another symbol. Oh, it goes this way, actually. I, I know I have that one upside down. I'm pretty sure the monetary symbol for, the, for that country goes this way. Is that it? Uh, oh, here's another one. Uh, this one's from the UK somewhere in French. Uh, I shouldn't say because then people get mad. I don't know. I don't memorize all the monetary uh, uh, countries' uh, symbols. But anyways, like the decorations, when this first came out, they came in with like three or four colors right away. Eh, it was not popular. But it's nice to see it come back. And here's where you can open up. Do I have any money? Let's see. Uh, stick it in there. Now you got something uh, to hold your money. And also the first release, uh, this thing it didn't stay in very good. You could pop it out really easy. But sometimes you see this, see this car, and it's missing this thing. But uh, it still gives you a little uh, cool little mobster vehicle. Anyways, that's enough already about fast cash. Let's uh, move on with fast cash. Here you have the 17 Ford GT, the regular version. Uh, two samples of the regular version. And here you have the Ford Shelby GT 350R. Very nice. Now let's go ahead and uh, compare. Now you see, this looks great as its, as its own, but as you can tell, it's a different color for the Super and definitely different wheels. No T, you see the TH logo indicating Super Treasure. There is no TH on the regular version. Uh, rubber tires, are these, oh, they do have treads. These, this one right here, same color base. The Super was produced J17, just for the heck of it. Hey, wasn't the other one in the 20s? Where is it? J17, there you go, J17. And these J20, wow, they made, they made the Supers like, uh, uh, over a month ahead of time. No wonder why, uh, never mind. You know what I was gonna say. Also, behind the car, because it's a treasure hunt, there's the uh, Circle Flame logo, indicating that it is a treasure hunt. Technically a super treasure hunt. Now, here we have the custom Ford Bronco. Been a casting change in the back. If you're a fan of this casting, it has been changed. I wanna move on. Porsche Carrera GT. Porsche Carrera GT. Here you have the Toyota Supra. Here you have the Baja Bone Shaker. So we have two samples of the Bone Shaker in this casting case. You have the uh, Baja Bone Shaker, but the first version of the Bone Shaker. This is the original version of the Bone Shaker. And it's in the Mild to Wild series. But I don't know which one's mild and which one's wild. I think they're, uh, I think they're both and both. I don't know which, which one's supposed to be the wild version. I don't know. HW tool in one. This is a little ball bottle opener. You have carbonator, so you can open up your uh, soda pops or your frosty beverages. And this front part right here, as you can see, you use it to pull open your pull tabs so you don't hurt your fingernails. 65 Pontiac GTO, another model from the Flame series. Uh, oh, yeah, good. We get a yellow submarine. Blade Raider, two samples of Blade Raider. Once again, a 2016 new model. And I do believe this was the first appearance in the end cases. 26, I mean, uh, 70 Camaro, another one from the Flame series. Fan favorite. Here you have the 69 Dodge Charger 500. Hey, it kind of looks like that uh, car, Monster Jam, that uh, Grease Monkey, Monkey Garage. Garage Monkey, I forgot. Kind of looks like that, actually, doesn't it? Let's see, Vela Chita, Vela Cita. As a matter of fact, that car is in the uh, big Ultimate Garage. You see me over there? I'm doing a video. The, uh, that car is included in the uh, garage, and this time, uh, the Ultimate Garage. Howlin' Heat, this is your basic treasure hunt for the end cases. They're not in every case. Treasure hunts, one per case, if it's in the case, and there is the... Uh, basic treasure hunt logo and it says this symbol means you found a uh, collectible treasure hunt car and uh, you seen what the it was easier to see oh yeah I could do it this way no can't do it anyway oh and someone pointed this out and I didn't notice for a long time look the super has a gold logo because it's super right 
and just a silver or gray for the basic. That Circle Flame logo, you can see it right here. There's your Circle Flame logo, indicating that this is a uh, basic treasure hunt. Here you have the yellow submarine, the Beatles yellow submarine. Continuing into the end case, it was in a case before that. I don't remember the original, the very first case it came in, I don't know. Formula flashback, there you have another sample, uh, another sample, and here you have Tank Mater. By the way, Super Treasure on the same thing, right? Not going to be in every case. As a matter of fact, I only get like, a, well, I'm on a, I'm on a little, little bit of a streak right here. But seriously, it's like one in every 20 cases, maybe. Tank Nader and 17 Acura NSX. I'm glad to see this, this model return. I like this one. When this one was released in red earlier this year, uh, I liked that one. Picked up a couple of them. 67 Austin minivan. Just nice, simple graphics, right? Like a real car. And it is a real car, Austin minivan. Uh, I was going to say something. I forgot what it was. Oh, yeah, by the way, uh, I told you about track time where you can post a model or two, right? I do have a track time channel, and I'm looking for people to post suggestions for that channel, too. I'm going to do uh, track time. Here you have the minecart. It's a new for 2016. There's your Minecraft character, and the name of the car is Minecart. Uh, I forgot the name. Not Troll. Yeah, move on. Anyways, Epic Fast. I think there was already one in this case. So when you post a suggestion for track time here on this video, right, you're going to pick a model that was in this case, right? It has to be one of these cars for a track time presentation on Rage Screws. Um, and then I race some of the cars. And then you have a chance at a shout out. Now, over on the Track Time channel, I'm building a catalog of track, uh, track videos, right? Right now, I'm just doing snippets, and I'm looking for people to suggest models for a snippet. But I'm looking for a model that has lots of colors already. Like this 70 Camaro, this, this has been released mm, probably a lot, a lot of times, right? I need cars suggested for the Track Time channel, not this channel, Track Time channel. Post some suggestions for, um, for models you'd like to see get a snippet. And please, post a model that has several colorways. Uh, like, but don't post like the 4 GT, because there's only 4 GT. And it's one color. That's the only color that's been released before so far, right? So I'm looking for multiple colors. Anyways. Thank you for watching and happy collecting. Bye bye.